ladies and gentlemen, my name is Ben Siname. I'm from Bermuda State. Uh, Edmoga, to be precise. I'm from the Doma speaking side of Bermuda State. And musically, they call me Bename. I'm an artist, I'm a songwriter, I'm a performer, I'm a producer, I'm a big jockey, and I'm, I'm an entrepreneur. I'm a businessman. <laughs> Every day we didn't like to party. I don't complain till they got my body. Anywhere they... Yeah, I can remember way back. I was born in Kaduna, Kakuri to be precise. Yeah, I was told the story, so I'm a Kaduna born. When it comes to growing up, uh, it's kind of mixed because I didn't grow up in a particular place. I grew up in Banu State, I grew up in Niger State, I was actually, um, I was actually born in Kaduna and uh, I grew up also in Abuja and I'm here in Lagos, so it's, you know, these places, because I spent time in these places, I schooled in most of the places, so. Yeah, it was, it was cool because, uh, you know, as uh, the firstborn of the family, uh, it was beautiful. Uh, my dad, my mom, they were really cool people. So I think, I, if, if I must say it, I enjoyed my growing up. And because way back, it, it used to be me, my younger brother, and my younger sister came through, and the other one came through. So as a firstborn, it was beautiful. I mean, I grew up good. You know. uh, I grew up loving music and I remember way back my father gave me a gift um, of uh, a radio you know give me a radio as a gift in one of my bad days then I was quite young and uh, each time I keep wondering you know because I was a child and I keep wondering how and who are they talking on the radio and I, I enjoy each time I listen to them talk, I enjoy it. I enjoy the music I hear from the radio, you know. So I started learning how to sing, and gradually I started falling in love with music, you know. But actually, music was not what I thought I was going to do. I thought I was going to be a footballer because I don't like being in the crowd, you know what I'm saying? So I thought I was going to be, I wanted to stand out, you know. But you know, at football, uh, football is. Uh, Actually, my parents don't like football. My father in particular, he doesn't like football, you know, so, but he loved music because he used to sing. And, uh, you know, I fell in love with music and music fell in love with me, so. Uh, I've been doing music as long as I can remember, you know, it's been, it's been a while. But professionally, uh, that's been since I dropped a Party People album, probably for a period of um, eight years or something. Eight years. So. Yeah, of course. Uh, not just not just Browning single. I have an EP called Groove on Tone. It's out right now. Uh, the video I just dropped one video from uh, the EP called um, Naughty, and of course, you know what I'm talking about. Uh, I do Afrofusion with um, some soul in it, you know, but you know, we here, I call it Bobo Tibu. <laughs> so it's a mix of all of this put together. Yeah, uh, reaction has been, it's been amazing, it's been amazing because I'm this kind of person that I don't play with my stage and 
when I meet with my fans face to face. It's always um, a crazy time. It's always a crazy time for all of us. And um, I, I can remember vividly that time of party people. Party people was these songs that gets everybody crazy. So each time I'm, you know, on stage with my fans, it's always an amazing time. And uh, they connect to it a whole lot. My fans, uh, they are one very fans that you know, they can die, they can die for me. I can bet you that, I can bet you that. Party People, Party People is one very crazy song. And I'm sure um, anybody who knows about Party People, who is hearing me right now is gonna agree to that. Party People is one very crazy, very crazy song. And you know, of course, it put me out. You know, Party People, I think I recorded Party People in, I, I recorded Party People in Kaduna. That's been some time back, you know, and uh, Party People was amazing. This was actually the first song that actually brought me out. And uh, Party People was crazy. Party People was crazy. It took me everywhere. It was crazy. <laughs> yeah. So, you know, like, um, it's like going to school, you know, um, you keep going from class to class and I call it, for me, I call it the journey, you know, started learning how to sing on key, started learning how to, uh, uh, you know, compose music, do your own song, started learning how to go to studio, put money together to go to studio to record and all that. So it's been a journey. But trust me, it's worth it because it's the reason why we're still here and still relevant. So it's been beautiful. And it's it's been it, it's been amazing all through. You know what I'm saying? Because God and his mercy keep taking you from one stage of it to another and to another and to another. And here we are now. So it's been a beautiful journey. I'm gonna say. Abuja is a very Abuja is a very calm place compared to Lagos. Mm, probably, let me tell you, uh, musically, you know what I'm saying? Abuja is, um, yeah, we have a lot of music lovers in Abuja. You know, we do a lot of shows, a lot of stores, and all that in Abuja. But where the music business is, is Lagos. It's Lagos. No matter how big you are in any part of this country, if they don't know you for Lagos, see, ah, or more, <laughs> forget. <laughs> oh no, you never play. <laughs> If they don't know you for Lagos, bros, forget that. You know, understand what I'm saying? So, Lagos might be the place. The place gone, 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 where they happen. You understand? But like I said, Abuja has been a journey in Abuja. And it's been beautiful. Abuja people, then too much. And one thing I must say, if Abuja crowd accept you, any other crowd here accept you anywhere. And I'm saying, you know, say Abuja are big boys, are big people, big boys. Now then, did that, so they don't really send you like that. But the thing is, if you can be able to pull their heart, if you can be able to control that musically, then trust me, you know, you can be accepted anywhere. You know, like you know, like in Lagos, yeah. If you, once you're good, people accept you too quickly. But it's not like that in Abuja. If you you don't need to be good, you have to be extra extra good you know, to be accepted in Abuja. But I must say, Abuja is beautiful. It's a beautiful, I think it's a beautiful place to start from. Talk about the likes of um, um, Star Plus, you know, talk about Magneto right now, talk about, and a lot of them, a lot of them started from there. MI, P-Square, lots, lots and lots of them. Uh, ice creams, lots of them, you know what I'm saying? And, and it's a good background, it's a good background to start. It's a good platform. It's, it's a good place to start from. Because if you can kill it there, you can kill it anywhere. Abuja, I rep now. <laughs> nice zone, Abuja. And life in Lagos. 
Okay, let me tell you about life in Lagos. I might not be right or completely right, but um, life in Lagos is not the life, it's not like the life in Abuja. Trust me. <laughs> They're not full of. <laughs> You know, like way back when we did Abuja, we did it calm, you know, all this no pick me dirty kind of work out. All more for Lagos, you know, you know, who work like that. You know, but I love, I love a lot of things about Lagos. Lagos will make you know that, man, you're far away from home. You know what I'm saying? You spend a lot of money to get here. So you need to work. Lagos will make you work. Because if you don't work, nobody will hear you. You know what I'm saying? So life in, La in, in Lagos is a very is beautiful because the more you work hard, the more you enjoy. You know what I'm saying? And I love Lagos because Lagos is kind of a place that they accept people. You know what I'm saying? It doesn't matter whether you are a Lagosian or you speak Yoruba, but if you're in Lagos and you are good in what you do, Lagos will accept you. So life in Lagos is beautiful, but trust me, if you're coming from outside into Lagos, do know that Lagos, when you're in Lagos, you need to work. You need to work hard because almost every musician where the Lagos is good. You know what I'm saying? Uh, if you're not good, you can't even leave your place in the first place to come to Lagos. So, And Lagos is a whole lot of, there are traffic of good stars and everything. So you have to stand out and that involves your working. So you need to work. That's what Lagos is about. In Lagos, you must work. <laughs> if I want to be very honest here, uh, what in in inspires me is the love for humanity. Love for humanity inspires me a lot. Because I believe if I have a fan, the fan is loving me for a reason. So if I disappoint him or her, I didn't only disappoint him or probably if I disappoint myself by not making up to the fan, I disappoint me and I disappoint him or her. I try as much as possible to make sure the person who is believing in me is happy. So it makes me go extra mile. It makes me have all these sleepless nights to make sure that works. You know, so the long and short of the story is the people I see around, the people who say, I love what you're doing, the people who say, who love me, who love what I do, that inspire me a lot because I want to do more. I want to make them happy by doing more. I want to make them love me more. So that inspire me a lot. And you know what it means. If you have, if you do what you're doing and you're blessed, you want to give back to the society, you know what I'm saying? So that, that fact that you want to give back to the society inspires you to do a lot more, to be better, so that you can have it to give back. So these are the things that actually inspire me. Ruben Tron is my latest EP and uh, it's still selling speedily. Is available on all platforms. On the EP, uh, you know, it's a six-track EP. Dangote is one of the songs, and I love Dangote seriously because it's one song that that I I really wish what I sing about sing on the song happened to me because I want to find how to give back to the society. And you know, when you're trying to be that man at the top, you have a lot of people looking up to you and you want to give back to the society. You know what I'm saying? So that song is really, is, is, is a song that I love and it's a prayer for me. You know, then I have beautiful songs like um, Pretty Girl. You know, I have beautiful songs like Pretty Girl. Oh, boy. Ooh. You know, as I have songs like Pretty Girl, I have songs like um, Mercy. Uh, I have songs like Mercy. Mercy is a rubber dub, you know, stuff like that. Then I have songs like um, You Don't Be Mad. Hey, You Don't Be Mad. <laughs> Crazy street song, I must tell you. You know, and um, I got songs like um, 
go low go low yeah when you listen to go low you know it's time to go low <laughs> you know so i got go low go low is a very beautiful song go listen to it i got songs like um, of course naughty you know naughty i shot a video for naughty so it's already out beautiful check it out a lot of energy dance you know african dancing and everything on it then uh i have about six songs on that stuff yeah six songs like six songs pretty go yeah i got fine girls yeah i got fine girls that's for the ladies cool song yeah you're gonna listen to it beautiful song i must tell you you know what i'm saying Every Friday, we did like your party and i'm not <laughs> yeah, I have um uh I love Tuba Bay's my role model. Probably I don't sing like Tuba Bay though, but I like him a lot. And I love David Doe, I love Whiskey, I listen to Whiskey a lot, I listen to David Doe a lot. I listen to Bunna Boy a lot. And I listen I love Tiwa Tiwa Savage. Trust me. She's amazing. Um I listen to a lot of our Nigerian uh, musicians. I, I I love a lot of them, lots of them, lots of them. I love them, Mr. Easy. I love um I love a lot of them, Bado. I love them, you know. And um, I look up to them a lot, you know. I'm this kind of person that I love to take from here, from here, from here, and put it together, and uh, and make it work. So I have serious love for all of them okay let me do this one sir. i want to make money and be popular like dango say i want to build companies and employ people like dango say i want to be on the cover of a magazine and must be on the news headline, making Africa proud like Dango Te Baba Ngaribeg. My tutu news on the ground. I don't say I don't deserve them. Born up, beg, at a beg. Answer my prayer. Baba, answer my prayer. Cause I don't see I don't holy I beg us on my prayer. Baba beg you give me that grace where go change my life, change my life. Oh Lord, give me that grace where go transform me. Because no be by power, no be by say as I be sing, and no be by things where I know, no be by places where I go. Baba, I know. I'll be all qualified to ask for your blessings. Baba, not the kind grace. Why you they take the bless anybody where you choose? Baba, even if it's not because of me, I bet bless me because of my mama. And the people where they look up to me say, if I blow their life, don't better. Oh, 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 oh. I want to. Be on the cover of a magazine and must be on the news headline, making Africa proud like Dango Te Bamba Ngari Beg. The video for Nati is out. It's, I mean, uh, I think uh, came out last two days or something. Yeah, they're about. And it's really going everywhere. You know, uh, it's been a very beautiful testimony. People loving it. A lot of comments, beautiful comments on the video. And beside the video, it has a whole lot of energy. You know, Afro, I'm a piano is nothing is beautiful. Nutty is really, really beautiful. I love Nutty particularly. You know, but because it's, it's this kind of song that can get you on the dance floor without knowing it. You know, it, 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 it's, it's, it's addictive, you know. Uh, and the video, the video is, it's been, it's been beautiful. Beautiful comments, people loving it. The energy is crazy. And I want to say a shout out to 
uh, director H2O, you know, on that one. He shot the video. And again, I want to say this. I got J1, I got Joel in that video. And that means a lot to me. That means a lot to me. Joel and J1 on that video, that means a lot to me. You know, they came through for me. And I can't say thank you enough to J1. I can't say thank you enough to Joel Amadi of Kenneth Music. You guys are everything to me. I I I I can I can't say thank you enough. Thank you so 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 very much for coming through for that video. And I had a couple of old friends who came through. I mean, everybody who showed up who came through for that video. Thank you guys because you made it happen. Thank you. Thank you. And I want to say thank you, Janana. <laughs> Alright, to my fans. Hmm. First of all, I can't love you guys less. Because without you, nah. Mm -mm. I know the deal. You understand? I want to thank those guys who have been there right from the good one. You know, when I never even know whether I would really do this music set. You know, and um, I want to assure you guys that if you've been believing in me since then and until now, have reasons to do it because musically I'm just getting started. If you, if you be this person where they follow me right from time, you're going to say, I don't like to be dropped young when no to them. You know, I'd like to take my time to do my thing and when I do, um, you know, the, the result they always be positive. You know, it's not about pride, but I know we Nigerians we like good things. You know, so I take my time to do what I can do and do it the best way that I can. And I still believe that there are rooms to walk more, so I keep walking more every day to make sure that I don't get tired of what I do. So thank you guys, you guys are amazing. And like I say, I promise I will keep giving you what you want back, back, back to back. You know, then again, if not, if it's not listening to uh, Groove on Throne, please try do. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Groove on Throne is just like um, a peak. You know what I'm saying? So like I said, I'm on a journey and I'm getting started. So please don't get tired yet. There's too many things about to hit your uh, drums. I promise you that. Keep loving the brand Banana. Trust me, I'm not gonna fail you. Now me and you talk this one. And I'll hit my, my hand for chest for this one. I'm not gonna fail you. Thank you so much for loving me. Thank you for loving my music. Thank you for loving the brand Banana. I have um, my new EP will soon be ready, and uh, I'll be dropping single back to back. Um, I think the next single is supposed to be dropping next month or thereabout, you know. But I'm putting that online first of all, and all that. But um, I'm, I'm in talk with my team, and uh, we're looking between now and between July, the next EP is gonna drop. But before then, it's going to be single, 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 single. And trust me, let's get into business. We're here. We are sad. <laughs> we are sad. We're not going inside until we get there. There's no time to sleep. Let's keep working, bro. Let's keep working so that we can make you happy. I'm simply Bename. You know, B E N A M E H. Ben and Ame put together. That's Ben Ame. Then on my social media handles, IG, it's official Ben Ame. On Twitter, it is I am Ben Ame put together. One word. Then our uh, Facebook page is Ben Ame official. You know, then of course on Facebook, Ben Ame, you know, no single word, just Ben Ame, you know, and 
my 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 songs, my jobs, all my jobs are on all social media platforms. Just hit Google and you have me. Hmm? Everywhere. Like MTN. <laughs> yes, so yes, so like my senior girl talker. Yes, so my people, not to be happy. We day here. We here for you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. And again, I want to thank uh, Boomhouse TV. Uh, Boomhouse TV has been uh, the owner has been my friend. We've been on the show. We are like soldiers of the same struggle. And uh, these guys have been amazing. You know, we've been working together, we've been doing things together, we've been going places together. And Long Mouse, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. I love you all. I love you so much. I love you so much. Thank you. Thank you for all the love. Thank you. I'm grateful.